Wind, solar, and other renewable energies are changing the way that Minnesota families power their homes. Harnessing all of that juice is the goal of a new project launched by Great River Energy. WCCO's Alan Henry joined their team in Maple Grove as they work to upgrade the grid, giving them and it more power. A drone in two minutes is all it takes to install a Heimdall neuron onto a power line. Inside a neuron, thousands of dollars worth of sensors feeding back data about the power line in real time. Everything from temperature, angle, wind speed, and more. What this technology does is it gives us much more, many more insights into all the factors that influence how much power can flow on a line. This actually does draw its power directly from the power line. So uh, it uh, can be up on the line for potentially decades without any maintenance. Uh, it has a battery, so if the line ever falls out, it will still send data for uh, six months. A pilot program by Great River Energy last year used just four neurons, but estimated the utility could increase capacity by more than 40% using the tech. This month, they're rolling out 52 neurons. This power supply change is helping us be able to comply with Minnesota's carbon-free standard by 2040. With more new energy sources connecting to the grid, Great River Energy says the knowledge the neurons provide is power, literally, allowing them to send more power over more lines safely and reliably. Uh, a utility like Great River Energy will be able to increase the capacity on their lines by 30 to 40 percent uh, at a fraction of the cost and time of putting up a new power line. And that ultimately results in reduced costs for our customers. On top of that, with technology like this, we can delay capital investments and reprioritize those dollars to other projects that our members need. Alan Henry, WCCO News. The Heimdall neurons can also be useful during outages and maintenance, allowing crews to pinpoint problems on the grid quicker than before.